Hey, welcome to my channel. I'm cooking with manual focus and today, hey, we're making that in and out flying Dutchman burger. Now it's been all the craze over the internet. You've probably seen it on TikTok, but today you see it right there. That onion bun, those juicy patties with that cheese. And you already know you gotta make a burger sauce with it. Just thinking about it, got my mouth watering already. So without further ado, hey, let's go down to this workstation and we're gonna focus on this delicious flying Dutchman. All right, fam, this is what you wanna go with. You wanna go with a yellow onion and you wanna go with the large one because what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut this middle out right here and that's gonna make for your onion bun so we're gonna get this unwrapped and we're gonna cut about a quarter of an inch a little bit more than a quarter of an inch that'll be the perfect size for your onion bun so we're gonna go ahead and do that and we'll be in the game all right fam so we got that onion unwrapped so like i said what we want to do is we want to get in the center of this and get you a sharp knife because you want to go right down like that and then we're gonna make a cut like i said you want to go about a quarter of an inch or maybe even like three-fourths of, of an inch and then just go straight down like that and fam this will be the perfect size for your onion bun so we'll go ahead and get some more prepared and we'll be in the game fam now fam i got my onion buns right now before I put these on the griddle, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sprinkle this with a little bit of sugar and this is gonna help caramelize these onions. So just a little pinch of sugar. And you rub that in front and back. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna set these to the side. And then fam, what we got here is a pound of 80 20 ground beef and we just gonna make you know even size hamburger patties and i don't want to make these like dense so i'm just gonna loosely roll these up because we're gonna smash these down like so so you should have about you know a quarter pound each patties now if you want to you can go you know half a pound if you like however much you know what i'm saying burger that you want Hey, that's what you make, right? Now, we're going to make this burger sauce. We're going to get all of this on that griddle. And we're going to be in the game, fam. Now, we're going in with that burger sauce. We're going in with mayo. Hey, that's the base of it. Now, what you can do, if you want a little kick, hit it with that sriracha sauce. But, hey, if you don't like that kick, hey, go in with that ketchup. So, today, you already know I like my spicy stuff. If you've been following me for a while. But today, we're going to use ketchup. We got a little bit of vinegar just to give it a little ting. I got some relish. And then I'm going to hit it with a little bit of mustard. Give me a little salt and pepper to taste. Damn fam, mix this up and then we'll let this chill in the fridge while we make these absolutely delicious burgers. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add just a tad bit more ketchup. And fam, you got your absolutely delicious burger sauce. Now let's get these onions on this griddle. We're in the game. All right fam, we're going in with those onions. All right, fam, once you cook these about three to five minutes on one side, you're going to flip it. And look at this too. Hey, like I said, Dollar Tree, baby. That's how we roll. And it makes these, flipping these onions absolutely simple. And fam, you also want to hit them with a little salt and pepper. Get them seasoned up. So what I'm going to do is we let these cook. Like I said, about three minutes each side. And I'm gonna move them to my cool zone over here while we work on these burgers. And we'll be in the game, fam. All right, fam, we're gonna go ahead and get these burgers on. We're gonna flatten these out, press these down. All right, fam, we're gonna keep it simple, seasoning garlic powder with that onion powder some pepper and we got that salt and then we'll go ahead and flip these burgers 
焼いて。I love it, crust fam. Now we're gonna hit it with that American cheese on top. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit it with two slices on each bun. Here's the key to keeping these onions together. It's that cheese, so we're gonna place those onions, those caramelized onions, on top of these cheese and burgers. And fam, that'll be the glue to hold everything together. But I'm gonna tell you, man, that smells absolutely delicious, fam. Now, fam, we're gonna flip these one more time. I'm gonna get underneath it like that. And like I said, check that out. Make it absolutely easy. Yes, sir. Look at that. Your boy got you in the game. And there you have it. Yes, sir. Hey, fam, look at that right there. You got your absolutely delicious flying Dutchman right there. Hey, look at that cheese. Look at that burger. Those caramelized onions. Yes, sir. And we got that sauce, right? So we got to take a little dip in that sauce, and we're going to give this bad boy a taste test. Mmm. Now that, when my phone messed up, that's good right there, fam. Ooh -wee. That's delicious, fam. Now, if you're new to my channel and you like this content and you want to get in the game, hey, go ahead, smash that subscribe button. Don't forget to like and share this video with your family and friends. Now, for the Focus fam that's been rolling me for a while, hey, what you waiting on? Go ahead and make that absolutely delicious Flying Dutchman burger. And fam, I got you in the game. Hey, but you already know what I got to do. I'm going to smash into the rest of this and I'm about to roll out. Peace.